triangulating a polygon, is converted into a set of triangles. Next I'll show how to implement the so-called ear clipping algorithm, to triangulate a polygon in JavaScript. Any simple polygon with at least four vertices, can be broken down into at least two ears. An ear of a polygon, is a triangle, with two sides being edges of the polygon, and the third one being inside the polygon. The ear clipping algorithm, consists of searching an ear, and cutting it off from current polygon. Repeat until there is only one triangle left. Given a set of points forming a polygon. The first step to triangulate it, is to compute the interior angle at each point. To do this, there are two functions we need to code up one that gives us the angle from three points and another that gives us the orientation of three points. Also, we'll need a function that constrains the indices of our rays between an upper and lower bound. In this way, it's time to define our function triangulate. Create a variable with the number of points, and a copy of it. Next, compute the orientation of the polygon. To do so, find the rightmost vertex point, and get the orientation of the triangle formed by, the previous point of the rightmost point, the rightmost point, and the next point of the rightmost point. In that order. Create an array to stock the angle at every vertex point. In each iteration, take three points, let's say, point A, point B, and point C. Now, Get the angle at point B, and the orientation of the three points. If the orientation doesn't match the orientation of the polygon, then we have a reflex angle, that is, 
an angle greater than pi radians. In that case we need to subtract 2 pi to the angle. Now we can start the triangulation. Create an array to stock the triangles. In each iteration, pick out the ear tip which has smallest angle, and create the corresponding triangle with it. Append this triangle to our stock of triangles, and proceed to remove the selected tip, updating the connections of the polygon, this will generate two new angles. This process will repeat, until n-2 triangles are constructed, with n being the number of points of the original polygon. Let's show the triangles.